is. Hi, it's me, Daisy. I'm so happy you're here with me today. Wait a sec. Can you see me? Because I can't see you. So happy you're here with me today because I love having friends around. That's why I got this. I love being with trees outside, so I thought, why not have a tree friend come live with me inside? Uh, at first, my tree friend seemed really happy, but now it's not looking so good. It's not growing, its leaves are falling off, and it's kind of droopy. Sometimes I feel droopy like this too, and usually it's when I'm hungry. That's it! Our tree friend must be hungry! Let's get it a snack! Here you go, tree! Eat up! Um, bowl of tea! Do trees have mouths? I want to help our tree friend, but trees don't have mouths. How do they eat? You know what this calls for. The Curiosity Corner. How do trees eat? Do you want to find out how trees eat too? Yes? Great. Then I need your help to get there. I need you to use your imagination and say the... Magical transportation spell! Ready? Okay. Off we go. We're on our way to have a fun and magical day! Wow! This place is so cool! I bet there's someone here who can help our tree friend feel better. Maybe I can help. What? A talking tree? No, it's me, Gardener Pauline. It's so good to see you. We have a tree friend who needs help right away. I love helping trees. What seems to be the matter? Well, I'm pretty sure it's hungry, but I made a sandwich, but I don't know how trees eat, do you? I sure do. Trees don't eat the same way that people and most animals do, so you can't just give it a sandwich. Then what can we do? Well, let's think. You need food and nutrients to grow and play and do all sorts of things. <gasps> like this. That's right, Daisy. For example, you need food to do that dance. But trees can soak up energy and nutrients straight from the sun and soil. Wow, that sounds magic. It kind of is. <laughs> Look here. Tree leaves are full of chlorophyll, a green substance that captures energy from the sun. Is chlorophyll what makes trees, grass, and other plants green? It sure is. They all have it. And they also have roots underground, which absorb water and nutrients from the soil. Water, nutrients, and energy from the sun give the tree everything it needs to grow and be healthy without ever eating a sandwich. <gasps> wow, that is magic. But if our tree doesn't need a sandwich, then how can we help it? Hmm, I'm not sure. Can you show it to me? Sure, it's in my kitchen. Your tree is inside? Yes. Well, that's your problem right there, Daisy. Do you remember the three things I said trees need to grow and be healthy? I think so. Do you? They need water, energy from the sun, and nutrients from the soil. Yep, and sunlight and soil <gasps> are the two things our tree doesn't have inside. We need to get your tree outside and planted right away. One tree coming right up. Now we have to find the perfect spot for it. How about here? There's plenty of sunlight and the soil looks rich. Perfect. Next step, we dig a hole. 
We could use a shovel, but I like to use an excavator. <gasps> wow! It looks like a big dinosaur! How does it work? My friend Dave will show you. Dave, can you help us bring the tree to the hole? Thanks, Dave. Thank you, Dave. Look here. These are the roots. The roots are like giant fingers that hold a tree in place and absorb water and nutrients from the soil. So the roots are like big straws that suck up everything they need. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> now, let's loosen up the roots with our hands before we plant it. A nice little tree massage. Yes, that will help it absorb more. Now, let's get your tree friend in the ground so it can start to feel better. <laughs> do you want to try it? I do! All right, let's go. Now, let's get those roots covered, but not too deep. They say, plant them low, they'll never grow. Plant them high, they'll reach the sky. Plant them low, they'll never grow. Plant them high, they'll reach the sky. <laughs> I love it. And now, I'll give it a big drink of water. Oh, tree, you look great! Thank you so much, Gardener Pauline. Oh, I'm always happy to help a friend. Or two. Come back and visit anytime. I can't wait. Bye bye. That was fun. And we can visit our tree friend anytime. It's happy and healthy now, all because of you. Thank you so much for coming on an adventure with me. I had a wonderful time with you.